Pakistan's Asif Ali Zadari has finally caved in to his rival's mounting pressure over the judges issue. But does that mean a victory for the opposition? And will it prevent further turmoil in the country? This is Inside Story. Welcome to the show. I'm Mariam Namazi. Former Chief Justice of Pakistan, Iftikhar Mohammad Chowdhury, and other deposed judges are about to get their jobs back. In a surprise move, President Asif Ali Zadari gave in to the demand after days of protest marches led by opposition leader Nawaz Sharif. Sayna Khoda reports on why the reinstating of the judges is such a controversial issue for Pakistan. No one here could hide their excitement. Supporters of the opposition and the lawyers' movement say the rule of law has prevailed. They gathered outside the home of Iftikhar Chaudhry, the former Supreme Court Chief Justice, minutes after it was announced he would be reinstated. A main demand of the opposition that led them to call off the long march protest. Pakistan. On behalf of the President of Pakistan and myself, I announce the restoration of all deposed judges to their positions including Iftikhar Muhammad Chowdhury. On March the 21st, upon retirement of Justice Abdul Hamid Doga, Chief Justice Iftikhar Muhammad Chowdhury will assume office of the Chief Justice. Notification of this is being issued right now. It has been a long struggle for the lawyers' movement, over two years. Ever since Chaudhry, along with scores of other judges, were sacked by then-President Pervez Musharraf. It came so late because of the pressure which was made and was enforced by the legal fraternity along with all the political parties, along with the civil society, along with the students. So we re feel really proud of the decision. The political turmoil was about restoring faith in a proper legal system. Many see Chaudhry as the man who can do just that, a symbol of resistance since he did resist pressure from Musharraf before being suspended in March 2007. Many believe Musharraf did that to preempt a decision that could challenge his legality as president, and the opposition accusing President Asif Zardari of doing the same, fearing Chaudhry could limit presidential powers and reopen corruption charges against him. Zardari had campaigned on a promise to uphold an independent judiciary and reinstate the judges. Go Zardari go! That is what opposition supporters are chanting. It's the same slogans that were used months before former President Pervez Musharraf was forced from power. Pakistanis view the events of the recent days as a replica of the political turmoil.